I can't, I can't, bro, I can't. Welcome back to another video. How are you guys doing today? Today's video, before we get straight into it, I just want to say, if you guys haven't checked out the recent two videos that I uploaded in the last two days, make sure to go check it out. I'm going to put it in the right hand corner so you guys can go check it out after you're done watching this video. I appreciate all the love. Anyways, with that being said, today's video, we are going to be doing a Q&A for the new year. The last time I've done a Q&A has been, like, it's been a while. I could probably say maybe over a year ago if I'm right probably about a year ago and it's been a little while but you know what I had to end this year good when I ended what the fuck am I talking about? what I had to start this year good because you know it's a new year and so I'm like you know what we got we gotta we gotta push these videos out and I was like you know what let's do a Q&A why not you know it doesn't hurt to do a Q&A so I asked you guys on my Instagram ask me some questions for my Q&A and you, some of you guys responded so we're gonna get into that, but before we get straight into that, I just wanna say if you're new to the channel, feel free to hit that subscribe button for me. We on the road to 3k subscribers. With that being said, I love you guys, and let's get straight into this video. So, all right, so for the first question, it is, what is the worst advice you've ever given? Damn. Now I got, okay, that's a good question. Now I have to think about this, honestly. I really gotta think about this. I'll probably say, hmm, wow. Wow, the worst advice I've given. Holy crap, like, I really gotta think, think deep into this. Um, I'll probably say, and this is probably just based off experience, okay? I'm not entirely sure about this, but I'll probably say that the worst advice I probably have given is maybe it has to do with girls. And the reason why I say this is because, yes, I, I have experience like knowing how girls are and stuff like that. I have way more knowledge than I did many years ago. But to this day, I'm still learning how girls are. I'm still, because there's always room for you to learn something new. And so with me, I feel like that I'm always just gonna keep learning. What, it doesn't even, forget girls, okay? Just learning in general too. It could be about like, you know, like a major you're doing or a subject you're learning in school. Like you always constantly learning. Like you will never reach your peak. Your peak is up here, but you're just gonna keep going up, going up and like, until you reach your full potential, you know? But aside from that, um, I probably feel like the worst advice I could give though is with girls because you know I mean I can try to get the best advice of my knowledge but sometimes it may not go the way that that person would want it to go because I wouldn't know that person like for example let's say I have a friend and he knows this particular girl right and he has a crush on the girl but like he known the girl for about I'll say maybe about a month right so he comes up to me for advice, say, hey, um, I really like this girl, but I don't know what I should do. I don't know if I should make another move or I don't know what I should do, you know? So in the best advice of my knowledge, I would try to tell him, like, hey, you know, just tell her how you really feel this and that and stuff. And like, like I said, I would try to give him the best advice, nothing negative, try to be positive. And let's say I give him that type of advice, right? And he goes, he takes my advice and then it doesn't go the way he expected to. You know what I mean? Like, like that type of stuff, you know, I feel like. Like, my advice on that subject, I don't feel like it's bad, but I feel like it could be better, though. You know what I mean? So, and when it comes to that subject, too, I'm seeking other people's advice. Like, I'm not even seeking really my own advice. I'm seeking other people's advice. You know what I mean? So, I'd probably say maybe girls. That's probably maybe the worst advice that I could give. Well, not even worse, because it's not the worst thing. It's probably my... My least best trait when it comes to advice, if I could say. On that subject, at least I could say. So, I probably have to say that. Okay, so the next question is, what's your favorite song? Whew. You guys got me think. Oh, my phone! That's out the season, <laughs> you, the season <laughs> you guys got me thinking. I know what you guys are doing. You really trying to get me to think, but I like it though. I like it. Honestly, if we talk about favorite song, are we talking about all time or are we talking about right now? Because I think all time, 
Damn, that is hard. I'll probably say my favorite song all time is probably Mob Deep Hell on Earth. And hey, yo, what's hell on earth? Who's next? I'm gonna be first. I'll probably say that. That's that's one of my favorite songs probably of all time. But if we're talking about favorite song right now, right now, I'm probably gonna have to go with I'll probably say favorite song right now, Chief Keith Feneto. Fenito, Fenito? Uh, I think that's how you say it. I don't even know. <laughs> but I don't know what it was, but I've been listening to this song lately, and it's just I just been getting like like hype motivated, you know? Gas what I smoked. Like, like I don't know. I just been getting like really like high motivated. I don't know what it is, but I just been listening to Chief Keith. Recently, and I've been listening to his old songs recently too, and I'm like, damn, like, Cheeky been around for a while. We gotta give him more credit for what we gave him for, you know. And I was listening to the other song he had two posted. I think it was called Yes Sir. So yeah, I'll probably say right now that's probably my favorite song right now. But all time, it'll probably be Mob Deep. So the next question is, what color is your room? So I don't know if you guys can see a little bit of it. You can probably see a little bit of it on the wall. This is like my awards and stuff like that. Don't worry about that. But the color, actually, it's like a light blue. Um, I'll probably say like a, a light, like a light. Okay, you guys know the the Memphis Grizzlies, right? From the NBA. You know how they got that light blue color? They have, I think it's like a dark blue on the jersey and a light blue. That light blue is basically the color of my room. And honestly, I thought about like, probably remodeling my room in the future. You guys would like to see that for a future video, remodeling my room, because I always thought about doing that. But right now, I mean, I don't know. But the future, yeah, I always thought about that. You guys want that? I mean, I don't know. Let me know. Let me know. All right, and for the last question, the last question has to go with, oh, man. I mean, I don't... I, I got I to put my hat for this one. I got to put my hat for this one. Let me see. Hold on. Hold on, I had to put my hat for this one. We, we we gotta we gotta see this. We gotta see this. So, would you ever get with me? And uh, you know, not for nothing. I'm kind of glad that I actually did it off the NGL app because when you ask a question, it's anonymous and it gets you thinking. You know, and sometimes I like to think. You know, so I mean, I don't know. If I knew who you were, it it really depends. Like. I, I, I don't know, I don't know. But all I'm gonna say is if if I know you and I, and I like you in some type of way, like where I could say like, hey, you're you're a really good person. Like, I think you're amazing. You're smart, you're funny. Then yeah, I'd probably give you a chance. That's my pretty much preference in girls. Like, that's what I'm seeking. And it's all about positive vibes too. Like, guys, like I left the drama in the past, man. Like. For the past month, when I haven't uploaded a YouTube video, let me tell you guys a little something. I've been going through like a lot of personal stuff and just really been thinking to myself. And I just really want to leave all the drama in the past. Like, I, I don't, me personally, I don't really try to bring drama or be about drama, but I'm just trying to eliminate every speck of drama dust like away from my life because I already go through too much as what it is already, you know? And what's the point of needing more of it if I'm already going through some stuff? You get, you get what I'm saying? So it's like, I'm just trying to leave that in the past, man. That's why I just really hope that this year can really be a good year, you know? But yeah, I'm just really all about positive vibes right now. Just, just have a good time. Just enjoy yourself. Enjoy the moment. Just enjoy life the way God was supposedly was supposed to present it to us. You know what I mean? So it really depends. This question, it, it, it really depends. If if I know who you are, maybe. But since I don't know who you are, then I I, I can't. I don't I don't know. But like I said, it just really all depends if I know you as a person and who you are. But yeah, guys, that was a little short Q and A. I know it was a, it wasn't that long, but hey, it's okay. I just wanted um to let you guys know that. I'm going to be trying this year to post as much as I can, like how I was doing the COVID times. Like, like this is about to be the third video in a row. I can't remember the last time I consistently uploaded three videos in a row. The most I've done, like, the past year or whatever, it was probably two in a row. But three? Nah, like, like I said, it's just like, I, I just feel different. I feel more motiv motivated. And as soon as I'm done 
recording this video that you guys are watching right now, I'm supposed to work on another video. So, so you know, I'm, I'm trying. I'm trying now, you know? So, we gotta get back on this grind, though. All right, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. It's your boy, Flamo. I love you so much, guys. Hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day. And, hey, remember, we on the road 3K subscribers. With that being said, I love you guys. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace.